What's going on everybody, Star Wars Talks here. Today I have some interesting news regarding the new Star Wars movie coming out that features Rey 15 years after the Rise of Skywalker. So this comes directly from ScreenRant.com. I'm sure you guys have heard of it, but it says Star Wars New Jedi Order plot synopsis reportedly revealed. Rey and her two apprentices shape the future. It says, the first Star Wars New Jedi Order plot synopsis has been reportedly revealed. Lucasfilm had originally revealed that Rey's new Star Wars film would take place 15 years after The Rise of Skywalker, but not much else was shared about the story. Per issue 1355 of Production Weekly, the first synopsis for what is being referred to as Star Wars New Jedi Order has been reportedly revealed, describing Rey's role in training two Jedi apprentices, one of which could shape the future of the galaxy. It says here, set roughly 15 years after Rey's victory over Palpatine at the end of Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker. The sequel delves into Rey's courageous endeavor to restore the Jedi Order, where she assumes the role of a mentor to two promising young students, a girl and a boy. As her training progresses, it becomes evident that the girl possesses extraordinary abilities, destined to emerge as a future leader. So it basically suggests that Rey Skywalker might indeed not be the film's sole main character, and that these two new Jedi apprentices will play an important role in the story, with only a brief mention of Palpatine and no mention of other sequel trilogy characters. This new Jedi Order synopsis hints at a fresh start for Star Wars, now focused on new characters. So I just want to point out the fact that we don't know the whole story of this movie yet. We only know this much as far as things go. Um, the news has only covered this much, but I also want to say that I'm kind of excited that they're just moving on from what they previously created because. You know, some of the characters and stuff did not really get the proper story that they needed in the Disney sequel trilogy. And I think that they're going to be able to help build Rey's character a little bit throughout this film. But I'm also pretty excited to see these new protagonists involved in this new story. I think that it's going to be pretty sweet seeing the Padawan and McMaster dynamic because we haven't got to see much of that on the big screen. But from what it sounds like, I definitely think the young girl apprentice is going to be the most powerful one and then she's probably going to carry on the jedi order after ray maybe passes away or whatever ray decides to do in the end of this movie like i said we don't really know much more than what we were given in this article but you know you got to be kind of excited for new star wars in general even if it's not your favorite characters or your favorite stories i'm not going to judge too much until the movie actually comes out but for now this is all we have i hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, i'm really hoping they just don't bring any old characters back at all I don't want to see Palpatine, I don't want to see Luke, I don't want to see any characters, not even Force Ghosts. Just leave it and just move on. Yeah, but thank you guys for watching. Hope you have a great day, and may the Force be with you.